Hi, are you sick of government bureaucracy? Well, I am. Sick of red tape because it it sort of it it puts you in a box, so it stops you being creative. You see, I currently work in a field where I have clients that I look after, and I have a certain set of skills that I know that I can use to help others uh, in a big way. But because of government red tape, those set of skills don't fit into the box that I'm supposed to work within. And it's really frustrating. And as a woman, and as a person that wants to grow and develop and continue to expand in my air of influence and my ability to help others, it stifles me and I'm sick of it. I don't want to be stifled anymore. I want to continue to learn. I want to continue to grow. I want to continue to develop and I am determined to be successful in my own right. Recently, my husband and I went overseas on a small short trip, too short. Next time we go, it'll be longer. But when we came back, uh, because we work for other people at the moment, um, I only got paid half of my holiday pay. And my, hus my husband's employer, who managed all the money uh, in the contracts that they have with his work, um, said that he didn't have any money to actually pay for the worker that was replacing my husband while he was away. Red tape, people that aren't quite honest, it's frustrating, it is frustrating. I don't know why my husband's manager wasn't putting aside money for his holiday pay because he should have been. And for me, well, my company just decided that they weren't going to pay me half of my holiday pay because I'd run out of leave. Frustrating, frustrating hair pulling stuff. It's just, it's more frustrating the longer I work for someone else. So I'm telling you now, if you can relate to how I feel, you know, when you've got, when you've got a family to feed and when you've got rent to pay and you've got a lot of things that, you know, you need to maintain, when someone above you says, oh, you know, we're not going to pay you just like that, um, it's not good enough. It's not good enough and I'm sick of it. The reason we went away was we wanted to rub shoulders with uh, some people that have been doing an on online business and it's all wrapped around a blogging platform. So if you like the idea of blogging, which I actually do, I uh, the, the potential of blogging is, is astronomical. You can have hundreds and hundreds of web pages or pieces of real estate on the internet, all with its own domain names, without the cost of setting up a huge website. And a blog is a bit more personal. People can comment on it. You can have different categories. You can put images, audios, videos, and do whatever text you like on it. You can plaster it around Facebook, Twitter, the internet, and you can learn how to advertise. It's a great, great, great avenue and you can expand. It doesn't tell you that you can't use your extra skills. It encourages you to expand. Within this actual platform, um, there are personal development programs and there are marketing programs and business concepts to help you to really promote this over the internet. And in, over the internet, you have got thousands upon thousands and thousands of people that are looking for specific niches. You are targeting the world. You are not just targeting your town if you want to expand. But if you want to stay local, that's fine. You can make it work for you as well. So are you sick of government bureaucracy? Are you sick of feeling like you are trapped? Are you sick of feeling like you are being squashed because you don't have to be. We're looking for people that want to join me and use a blogging platform to generate a business income.
So the generating their business income is actually a very lucrative option with the way they've got it set up. Did you know with it, they have 70% and above commissions that they pay to their members. That is actually almost unheard of in the industry. Now I must say here, uh, there's an income disclaimer um, that we need to just say you know, the results are not typical for every single person. It depends on the amount of work that they put into their blogs, they put into their business. So you might make money out of it, you might not. But the people that usually do the work and have the mindset up here, make money and make a lot of money. When we were at the Empower Network uh, event, we saw five new people receive $1 million earner rings. And they've received them within a few years. So that's how powerful it can be. And, uh, and the stage was full of people that had been asked to stand up who had actually made an income from the business. It's a very lucrative business and now they have an even easier setup to help you to start. So the business starts generating income straight away and it pays for all the ingoing expenses and gives you a lot more uh, a lot more income and a lot more profit. So we're starting a journey. We've just started it and we're just about to embark on um, some real advertising as well. They have a calculator in their uh, program that helps you to know what to put in and know how much you're going to get out of it. So we're going to try that. They have one-on-one -on -one coaches as well. I found in the past that uh, I have dabbled in looking at different online businesses and uh, and there's often not much support. And uh, and that's, that's where you fall down. Uh, that's where it's hard to keep going. You know, something doesn't work and you think, oh my gosh, I don't have time to go through this. It doesn't work. I have to nut it out myself. Well, in this business, you're not alone. You have someone to talk to. And you can click on the button below and you will have me to support you via, if you're overseas and you've seen this video, I can support you via video and via Skype. And I look forward to meeting you in it at an event. If you are in Australia, because I am in Australia, um, I'd love to call you on the phone. Uh, I'd love you to call me on the phone. So we can support each other, help each other set it up. But it depends on you. Where are you and what do you want out of life? Are you happy where you are at the moment? Have you come to a point in your life where, you know, heck, half of my life is gone. What have I done and where do I want to go? Have you got a bucket list? Things you want to achieve? Have you got things that you've wanted to do with your children, with your parents? It's time now to step forward and move. Do something different. Step out of your comfort zone. Change your direction and reach your goals. Click on the links that I've put within this, underneath this, um, this video and come and join me because I'm on the journey and I want you to get on the journey too. All right, I look forward to talking to you soon.